Okay, this is uh, sort of what I was after um, with this project of an electrostatic motor that used a very small negative ion generator. This is the necklace one that um, you wear around your neck that runs um, at least 12 hours. And then um, charging it with a solar panel. Now this solar panel has a big long cord on it and it was out of this uh, project, or not project, but this item here that I've used on the boat which is a light that has a lithium battery inside it and we use it on the boat and you charge it during the day with this and this gives us light for the night and I've used this for years and it works great and this would be the same kind of thing uh, it just plugs into the back of this it's a mini USB port and uh, the green light means it's fully charged when it needs charging that turns red and uh, what would happen on this is it would run through the night or it would actually run from the afternoon when that stops getting enough energy on it and then uh, even if it stopped in the morning as soon as this panel charged this uh, USB uh, powered uh, negative ion generator up the electromagnetic uh, electrostatic motor would start up and uh, anyway this is what I had in mind um, this is actually in my kitchen you can see the reflection right there that's a skylight right above the stove there and uh, that's got enough light coming through the skylight to today to to make the charging thing happen um, like I say when this needs charging that turns red and when it's charging up and uh, right now it's it's not only on but it's supposedly charging because the green lights on anyway this was the idea was to make a an electrostatic motor that ran uh, most of the time I wouldn't say all the time but I'd say most of the time and this will run through the evening till about normally till about um, 11 12 o'clock at night and then it'll shut off and then uh, when you're asleep it wouldn't run and then in the morning when uh, the sun charged up enough energy into that lithium ion battery right there the thing would start up again and then run through the day and then run through the evening till it ran out of juice um, anyway that's that's kind of what I was out with this project here uh, was something like that uh, this one here that I bought, my uh, granddad had one of these and he turned me to a, a video uh, by Big Clive who I think invented the jewel thief. But Big Clive took that apart and diagrammed the circuit and analyzed it and it doesn't run all the time. It runs five minutes and then it's off for 55 minutes and that's how they get the long multiple day run out of this and that won't work for that kind of setup what I thought I might do is uh, try to set it up so that during the five minutes per hour that it's on it charges up a fairly stout high voltage capacitor that would run the device while it's off and then uh, every uh, hour it would charge up the capacitor again and I've got a bunch of uh, videos showing how these electrostatic motors will run on uh, a high voltage capacitor so anyway, that's what I'm um, doing right now with this project, and uh, this was just uh, basically what I had in mind. Was a, It's a solar-powered electrostatic motor using a lithium battery to store the energy during the day and then run it during the night, and then in the morning when the sun comes up, even if it's stopped, I can make these electrostatic motors so that they self-start as soon as the uh, the thing is excited with high voltage that's the latest thanks for watching